96-year-old Paige Wilson loves the Georgetown house she's called home for the last five decades. I don't want to go to what I call a going, going, gone place. <laughs> uh, I want to stay here. Paige and other seniors in her neighborhood got together to found Georgetown Village. They pay a membership fee, and the organization connects them with volunteers who lend a helping hand. Paige, how are you? Good to see you again. Like Jim Smith. After Paige broke her foot, Jim came over to make calls for a follow-up appointment. And she is trying to figure out who her main physician was. He's assisted other village members with medical bills and household repairs. It's the simple, you know, things you and I would consider to be simple that um, it's just such a big help. The village concept is catching on. Is it growing in Georgetown? Oh, absolutely. We're up to 190 members, and we only started two years ago. Lynn Golub Refrano keeps it all running from an office nearby. We'll put you in for a snow shovel. Members call with requests as often as they like, and village volunteers are dispatched. It's exciting to be um, part of the movement, part of the village movement. I get to be part of, you know, what's going to be the new face of aging in America. This group of people really does actually help you to stay in the home that you want to live oh, in. Oh, absolutely, yes, yes. One of the things that has surprised me about this, I guess, is how much I get out of it. I, I meet wonderful people. I always feel like I get just as much out of it as they do. A little bit of Jim's time goes a long way to help Paige keep her independence. Susan McGinnis, CBS News, Washington.